Hi, Mrs. Lambert here. Our next project is going to be of a landscape. A landscape is simply something that's out in nature. Um, our picture is going to have some trees, a road, some mountains, and a sky. This is what it will look like once we get done with the drawing. And then here's one that I made that has some color to it. There are a few things that we want to keep in mind when we're doing our drawing. One is the line that's going through the center of our paper. That line is called our horizon line. And that's the line that separates the land from the sky. So anytime we make a landscape picture, we always want to have that horizon line. Another thing we want to look at is the road. If you notice, the road is getting skinnier as it goes back into the distance. And that's what makes us think that it is going back in the distance because it's going from a large to a small. So things get smaller as they get further away. On this one with the color, notice I have three trees. One, two, three. So what's different about the third tree it's the smallest tree, so it makes it look like it's the furthest tree away from us. And then with the mountains, there's one more key thing we need to look at, okay? I have three mountains and three mountains. Some mountains look like they're behind other mountains, and that's what we call overlapping, when we make it look like one thing is in front of the other. So we have our road getting smaller as it goes off into the distance, our trees getting smaller as they go off into the distance, the horizon line, which is the line that separates the land and the sky, and then overlapping with the mountains. So those are the things that we really wanna keep in mind as we're doing our drawing. I went ahead and did step-by-step step for you, so follow along, you'll just need a piece of paper and a pencil. And then when you finish that, go ahead and color it with crayons, colored pencils, markers, paint, whatever you have at home. Okay, so have fun.